Hi, this is Augustine Hadelich. I am really, really excited to be back in Cleveland to perform with the Cleveland Orchestra again. And I've been looking forward to, this, to these concerts for a long time because this will be my first time to perform with them at Severance Hall. The last few times I played with them was at, at Blossom. And this week, I'm going to perform Prokofiev's second violin concerto. I think this is one of the most exciting and colorful concertos in the repertoire. And I always think of Prokofiev as being a storyteller. Uh, many of his pieces are very descriptive and you, can, you just start imagining scenes of fairy tales and stories unfolding. And, and I think this one in particular, because it starts in a very mysterious way with the violin alone. And then the orchestra enters, but it has a very mysterious um, you know, my association to that is kind of, you know, yeah, magic, and it's 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 nighttime, and it's a little bit it's a little bit dangerous, and I think it's not an it's not a coincidence that John Williams, when he was composing the theme for Harry Potter, chose exactly the same pitches as the beginning of Prokofiev, in the same key, and to actually capture that exact same feeling. Um, there are a lot of other very descriptive, descriptive moments in the piece. For example, piece, uh, places where, I'm, where I put on a mute and play things like... Or things like... It sort of sounds like the wind howling. Uh, and I, I think one of, the most, one of the most exciting endings, actually, of any violin concerto. So I'm really looking forward to playing this this week. <laughs>